Got it set up. Got some more final wiring you gotta do. Just got turned on, it's looking for the sun. It's over to the west. It's adjusting. Sweet. I got a panel little small panel here what it does is it goes in and it goes through a charge controller and it charges up a battery that is inside this water tight box and so what it does is it keeps the battery charged with the small panel and then that controls and gives energy to the controller let's move it again so it's readjusting it's not finished with its adjustment so it's sun is quite a ways to the west it's gonna be about maxed out here probably anyways we're gonna run it without the panels for a couple days see how it does without any panels on it uh, checking make sure we got slack and all the cabling everything seems to be doing fine all this will be basically under roof once I get the panels placed All there is the north, south, east, west tracking. And uh, I like the uh, tilt. It's got a pretty good tilt. It's probably just almost maxed out, and that's fine. That's, I wouldn't want it to go much farther because I don't want it to come down too low to where you may run into it when you're mowing or walking through the yard. So it's got good travel both directions, east and west, and of course, north and south is. It's almost level right now. Of course, it's you know spring going into summer, so that'll get even leveler and it may actually even tilt backward a little bit. So, so far so good. So we're gonna let it run. I may have some more tweaking to do. Uh, I do have an anemometer that I gotta make a mounting plate and I will place it down here. That's that wire that's hanging right there. And uh, I'm gonna make a plate for down here. Uh, probably we'll put it on the back side here or maybe on this this side over here not sure but uh, it will be set up to capture the wind speed and if we start getting a lot of high wind speeds then that will actually cause the controller to level out the panels therefore hopefully uh, keeping from damaging the whole setup panels and uh, everything uh, this should withstand some pretty good wind it's a thick wall, uh, at least eighth, and some of it's three sixteenths aluminum tubing, and uh, it's just slightly, just every little bit, you'll hear it adjust as the sun changes. So, getting really close. A few more days here. We're gonna have some rain tomorrow, unfortunately, but uh, we'll be. Uh, getting the panels on it hopefully by the weekend and we get to really test it we test it with a load all right see you guys